Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 2 of this Clan Dead Now tutorial. Uh, today's focus will be the ship's superstructure, or a good portion of it anyway, uh, so it consists of about three decks I believe. At least the area we're going to focus on anyway. So what we're going to do now is to head down to the ship itself, RMS Clan Dead Now. I'm really beginning to wish I didn't drop the castle from the name, but never mind. Anyway, what we're going to do now is go down to the back wall of the focal, which is this wall here, and back onto the centre block, which is just there. So there's the centre of the back wall, and we're down to the wood down here. And we're going to count this block as number one, and we're going to count back 36 blocks. So that's number one, like I say. And we're going to count back 36. So I'm going to measure as I go along. So it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 32, 3, 4, 5, and 6. On block 36, we'll put a red marker. So that's 36 blocks back on the wood, like so. So there's our marker, and that's our centre block of our front wall. And then we're going to build the front wall 11 wide, so that's uh, 5 either side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that way. So it looks like that. And then for the sides curving round, we're going to build out 5 again, so behind it go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 3, 1, 2, 3, and 3 again, 1, 2, 3, and then 2, 1, 2, and then 1, like that. And that's how that should be, that's curved it around, and then just go back to the other side, to the other side there, so it's 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 3, 1, 2, 3, 3 again, 1, 2, 3, 2, and 1, like that. And then you increase those walls to four high. So start in the centre, just build it to four high. So two, three, four. And I'll do one side, like so. Like so, I'm going to build out to the very side, and we're going to go down the side as well. So just build out to where we built the row of two. Like so, so there's the row of two there, and then this block one, this one block here, we're going to increase, we're going to make that two, so it's going to go out two like that, so increase that to four high like that, so it goes out to the side. And then you're going to build the side, the five blocks here, build them four high as well, so four high for the side blocks as well, so it connects to the side, the side white wall like that, so you've got a, a continuous wall going from the centre around to the side like that. So I just do the same near the side as well. I should pretty well edit this, but I can't be bothered. And then down this other side like that. And there we go, there's our continuous walls like that. So you've got a curved front wall like that. And uh, it don't look too bad. Alright, so that's that bit there. Now we go down to the side. We've got the side, one side wall done already, which is done in part one. So we go behind that to this single pillar here, like that. We've got a single pillar right on the outside edge of the ship. So you can see it right on the outside there. That side pillar like that. What you're going to do is build, is increase that side pillar to, to a wall, and you're going to build it 150 blocks long, all the way along the side. So I build it. I build a line first. I build the bottom line. So make that one there. So that's that block number one there and then make it 150 so I'll do the bottom line like so so do it row by row or line by line so well, a line of 150 150 that's what we want how many is that that is 86 so I'm, I'm counting it and I measure as I go along so. so 150 is what we want how far is that that's 133 and that is 148, 49, 50. So that's 150 like that. And then increase that to 4 high. So 2, 3, 4. And it's 1, 4 high. All along the side. So I shall weld it at this just to save a bit of time. So it's 150 blocks long, 4 blocks high. So that's what you want. i just do this quickly. Just to save a bit of time. So I, don't, I try to avoid using welded it, but sometimes you have to. So, oh! So that's the top high, and then you want the whole thing like that. There we go. So it's a whole wall of 150, like so. And then do the same the other side as well. I'll do that in a minute. I just want to get this one side out of the way first. Um, so that's 150. And then what we're going to do now is build a top line. So from this top block here only, we're going to build 
uh, a line of 32. So we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. And then after that, you build down 1, 2, 3, like that. So it creates an open promenade in that area there. So that's that. And then at the end, after that pillar, you just, you just add another one, two blocks there, make out four blocks high, like so. So there you go. So this is an opening here. You can probably just see on the prototype where that is there. You just see where the crosshairs are, is that area right there in the middle there. So that's that opening there. And it should look something like that. And then after that, you just add a line underneath as well to just close it off. Like so. And it should look something like that. And what you can do as well, get our white stairs, our court stairs, or whatever. Now I put a court stair. Actually, I don't do the court stairs yet. We do the pillars first. Um, what did I use on the prototype? I used end rods. So we use end rods first. So I put end rods in. And what we're going to do, go from the corner block, and then every fourth block we'll put a pillar. So that's one, two, three, four, pillar. One, two, three, four, pillar. One, two, three, four, pillar. One, two, three, four. Pillar one two three four pillar three four pillar one two three four pillar like that and there you go there's your end rods and then in the corners put a stair block to create the curve and there we go that's that open promenade area done like that so that's that one side done like that what I'm going to do now is I'll do the other side uh, I think what I'll do, I'll quickly copy it across because otherwise I'm going to be here all day. So it's exactly the same process. So it's 150 blocks from the end, from that single white pillar. 150 blocks to the end there. Make that four blocks high, and then 32 along the top, like so. Down, down three, and then add an extra two blocks at the end, like so. Add the line underneath, and then add the pillars, like so. So what I'm going to do, I should do a jump cut while I sort the other side out, and then we can move on. So um, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So there's both sides of the superstructure done so far, and it should look something like that. So what we're going to do now is go to the back end of where the pillars are, or at the end where the pillars are, sort of, uh, to the very end. I'm going to work on one side again as it is, so we're going to go right to the back end, like so. So at the end of the this white white wall here, we're going to go in one to this block here, and we're going to add a, a line of... Uh, 23, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. And then increase that to 4 high, so 2, 3, 4. Build that one along the side. Like so, connect it all up. Ignore the blocks I'm hanging on the side. There we go, so there's the 23 done there. And then what we'll do then is go to the other side and do the same there. So inside one, go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. And increase the 4, so 2, 3, 4. And 23 high, uh, 23 long, 4 blocks high, 23. that's that bit done there like that what we're going to do now then is to go to the back end of the ship to the stern very back end and we're going to build some inside walls so these walls will go inside the overhang of the superstructure if you look on the prototype over there which fly over there these inside walls will go inside an overhang like that and then you have an overhang over the top so we're going to do those do these inside walls first la 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 da -dee, da -dee, da -da 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 -da. So we're going to do get rid of the tip of the stern on the center block, which is actually center block is there. So on the wood, first block of the wood, that one there. We're going to count that as number one. We're going to count forward twenty blocks. So uh, one, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. So twenty, uh, twenty blocks forward there. Put a center block. Bonk. Now that's a twenty forward on the wood. And then this inside wall, this back wall. We're going to do one side at a time. I'll do the right side. Uh, we're going to build it seven wide, so that's three other sides, so one, two, three, one, two, three, so it's like that. And then out to the sides we want, out three, one, two, three, and then 
two and two and then forward two one two and then forward five one two three four five five again one two three four five and then seven one two three four five six seven and seven again one two three four five six seven and nine one two three four five six seven eight nine and then fifteen one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen and then three one two three and then out four one two three four like that and that's one side of your inside wall done do the same the other side as well but before I do that I'm going to build them to four uh, build them to three high so build the walls three blocks high so the deck will sit on top of them and in this space here this this wall of four and build a pair of doors in there like so so you build the rest of it three blocks high like so may take a bit of time but we'll get there like I say I'll do one side and I'll just copy it across because I'm going to add some doors and windows and things to this There we go, there's one side done, and it should look something like that. You can do the same on the other side, like I say, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to add some windows and doors first. So I put the first pair of doors in there like that, and what we'll do, we'll put, say, half a dozen windows, two blocks apart. Like This is just me randomising it, because it's a fictional ship, you don't have to do anything, it's gospel. So put one, two, three, four, five, put five windows, and then a pair of doors, and then just put as many as you want, or as few as you want, it's up to you. Three, four, five, and then another pair of doors, and then one, two, three windows, and then put a single door at the end, why not? And then just put windows around the back, so put a window there, window there, and a window on the centre. And, that, and then that's one side done like that. Now what you do there, just do the same on the other side like I say. I'm, I'm going to quickly copy paste that because it does take a little bit of time. Just quickly copy, flip to the right, and then paste. There we go, so there's the other side done. So you can see the wall like that. And it should look like that. And I do apologise once again if you're using WellDidIt, but it's a necessity because I can't be bothered to do two things twice. Or two things once. Whatever things, whatever. Right, well anyway, that's the inside walls done. So what we're going to do now is build the overhang which will go around the back end of the ship. So we'll go back to the four high walls uh, just here. So this is the 23 high, uh, 23 long wall. So we'll go from the top block here. And what we're going to do is extend that by two blocks. So we'll go one, two, like that. And then inside of that we're going to go 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So it's just the top line, remember. So there's the 15. And then 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. As long as it's following the contours of the ship that's down below. Uh, so that's two rows of seven, and then we want three, uh, two rows of five. Sorry, so one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, and then three, one, two, three, and then we want three rows of two. So two, 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 and then in two, one, two, and then in four, one, two, three, four, and four again, one, two, three, four, and then a color block to mark the center like that. And there you go. So there's the overhang, how it should look. And then we'll do the same on the other side. So back to the row of 23. To the top block there like that. So we want two. One, two like that. And then inside we wanted 15. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then two rows of 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then two rows of five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, and then three, one, two, three, and then three rows of two, one, two, one, two, one, two, two in, and then uh, uh, 
Hang on, what do I want? Two rows of four, wouldn't it? Yeah, two rows of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go, all linked up to the centre like so. And there's your overhang done like that. And uh, it don't look too bad. And then what we want to do then, before we start adding the deck and things, what we'll do then, we'll go back to the row of 20, the, the wall of 23, which is here. And on the bottom, from the bottom line, we're going to do what we did with the opening over there. We're just going to add a line of blocks along the bottom here. We're going to go as far from the row of 23, all the way to just below the, the last row of 3. So here's the last row of 3. We're just going to go to the end of that. So we'll just go back to our row of 23. So we'll add our 2 there, and then we'll just carry it along the side. Like so. Keep it connected up by one block like that. So overlap by one block like so. And just go all the way along the sides. Keeping an, keep an eye on what's above. Which basically just follows the contours of that. And you're just going to go as far as the last row of three. So here's the row of three. Just go as far as that. Build a row of three underneath it. And there you go. There's your, your uh, bits all linked up. And it should look something like that. So what you want to do now is to add your pillars, which are going to be every four blocks again. So uh, look at the prototype, and I think that's fine. So we'll go one, two, three, four, pillar, 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 and one, two, three, four, pillar. Like that, and you do have a couple of blocks spare, which is fine. So there you go. There's your uh, overhang and underhang done there. And just add the single row of stairs underneath the corner like that to create the curve overhang. Can't really tell much is going on, but we'll just do the same on the other side. Get it out of the way. So like I said, we'll just go from the bottom of the 23 and build until you get to that last row of three above. row of five, five, and then one, two, three, like that. And there we go. So then we just add our pillars. Every fourth block, so one, two, three, four, pillar, 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 there, one, two, three, four, pillar, there, one, two, three, four, pillar. One, two, three, four, pillar. One, two, three, four, pillar. And then we have two blocks spare. There we go. So that is our overhang done there, like that. All wonderful, nice and pretty. And do hickey do like that. So that is what we want there. There is going to be a bit more to do just over here with the inside walls because this is this open section here. You can either leave this open and just not have anything on the inside, but we'll leave it kind of open and bare. But what I'm going to do is just add some inside walls. Uh, this is me doing it random, so I don't know the exact dimensions of how this is going to be. But we'll just go on these from the inside walls. Go where you got the stairs in the corners. Just go two blocks forward of that. So you've got a bit of space there. So, so yeah, you can just look at it and you just go from there. So we're just going to build. So just go uh, one, two, uh, one, two, three, two blocks forward of the stairs. And then go one, two, three, four in. Go in five. Go five. One, two, three, four, five like that. And then just build. A line of blocks, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, long, and then back in 4, like so. So it just basically creates a small corridor uh, for your, uh, for your uh, promenade sort of thing, and then just increase these walls to 3 high, like so. I'll just build a freehand. Actually, I don't know why I just deleted those blocks, because I needed those, but never mind. So build these three high. Like so, and then we just add our doors or windows. So I put our doors at each end. Like so, and then just add windows all along the sides there. Window, 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 and you get the idea. Like that. All randomly spaced, but you know, that's how it is. So you get, you get a little open promenade there. So just do the same the other side. And I can't remember the exact details, but I'll just do the I'll just do the bottom line of it. So back 
to the other side and just go two blocks back of the uh, stairs and go out one, two, three, four, five. And then was it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, thirty one, thirty two, thirty three, thirty four. And then in four. And then just do the same as what I've done over that side. Build them to three high. And then uh, add your doors and windows, and that side will be fine, the same as that. And then you can start adding the deck. So, what we're going to do, I'm going to go to the back end of the ship and add the deck. And I'll, I'll finish that off during a jump cut, don't I? Uh, we'll go to the back end of this back end of the ship where the overhang is, the centre block, and we'll just add our wood blocks on the inside, like so. And this will go all the way forward to the front of the uh, of the superstructure. So, as you can see, the wall, uh, the deck sits on top of the inside walls, which is all nice and neat. And you just want to carry on this deck all the way to the front, and everything should be fine. So I'm going to do a quick jump cut while I sort the deck out and those inside walls, and then we can move on. So, uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So there's our deck added, and it should all look something like that. Big brown piece of wood all the way the whole length of the ship well almost the whole length because it just goes as far as the front of our superstructure here so what we're going to do now we're going to move on to the next deck of the superstructure so we're going to go to the front wall here the curved wall and on the wood center block we're going to go back to the fourth block back on the wood so we'll go one two three four bonk there for our center blocks so and what we're going to do we're going to do this next deck in two phases we're going to do the inside walls first and then we're going to do the outside overhangs because this is all promenade really, it's all almost all open promenade so you can just see where the crosshairs are there's that deck there which goes halfway along the ship so what we're going to do first then, we're going to build the inside wall so we're going to build 11 wide so 5 either side 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 like that and then behind that we want 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 3, 1, 2, 3, and then 2, 1, 2, 2 again, 1, 2, and back 2, 1, 2, like so. Do the same on the other side, so it's 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 3, 1, 2, 3, and then 2, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, back 2, like that. So there's your front walls, like that. And then I'm going to do one side at a time here, so after the row of 3, you going to want to build a line of 22 back, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. <sighs> and then a line of 1, 4, 3, so put the first block there. And then we want 143, so I put the measure of the first block, so that's block 1. And there's a line of 1, 4, 3, so that's quite a long line this one. 143 we want and then just increase what well, won't increase it yeah just build it along first so 143 and these walls are only going to be three blocks high because like I say these are be the inside walls how far is that that's 111 missed one and that is 136 that's 143 there we go so that's 143 like that and at the end of that you want to build inwards three, one, two, three, and then back four, one, two, three, four, and then inwards eleven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Plus a centre block there like that. So that's one side done. Like so. so what I'll do now, I'll quickly do the other side just to make sure it's symmetrical. So build go back to the line of two on this side and just build a line of twenty two. So we want 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And then the line of 1, was it? 1, 4, 3. Yeah. So, as we go along, Bonnie's barking. 143, what the hell was that? 143 is what we want, again. La 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 la. I really also put some music on just to sort of drown out the boredom. How far is that? That's 121. That's 137. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 143. So there's 143. Then we go inwards 3. 1, 2, 3. Back 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then in 11. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There we go. So that's all symmetrical. 
Ugh. And then we're going to do then just increase all those walls uh, to three blocks high. So I just do a little bit, and I'll do probably either a jump cut or while I edit it a little bit. Because <laughs> I'm lazy. Well, I'll, do, I'll just do these back walls freehand, and I'll do the rest of it while edit because I cannot be bothered. save a bit of time. La 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 da 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 Down to there so we do set quartz like so. I say build these all three high. <sighs> I say apologies for using well did it but people complain I'm too slow but then again they complain I'm too fast so what do I, I can't win. Same, and they just do the same the other side. La 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 la. And then this last piece. <coughs> down to there like so. Marvellous. So that's how that should look, well it looks like that. And then it's the same process as before to, do as it is to add doors and windows. Um, best thing to do is to leave the front walls, the front curved walls, here like so, so you've got the front curved wall like that. Best thing to do is to go from the row of 22 and start adding your doors and windows there. So I'll put a, win a window there and then put your doors in like so, I'm not going to do all of these. I'm not going to do all of these. I'm just going to do a few for a, a demonstration. So these are just randomly placed because, of course, it's a fictional ship. You can do what you like with it. So I put a few more windows in, and then a pair of doors, and then a few more windows. And a pair of doors. But you just carry on the whole thing down to, to end to the end. But basically, what I'll say, what, what I'd say to do, is to take the walls, uh, the doors or windows, all the way down to the end of the one four three. Basically, down to the end here. So put a window on the end to mark the end like that. And then the rest of the walls, around the back and the sides here, leave them until the end because you might need to add some stairs or things there. But just focus on the side walls for now. I shall, I shall finish them at a jump cut because, like I said, I can't really be doing too much of that right now. Okay, I'm just going to focus on main building first. So, <sighs> what we do now, we go to the front wall again. We're going to increase the height of the front wall. So, go to the front wall of 11 here, which is 11 wide. And we're going to build, increase the front wall here, the 11, high, 11 wide to 4 blocks high. Like so. And I'm going to focus on one side for a minute. So, the 4 high, 11 there. And then the 5 high, increase that to 4 high, like so. And then the row of 3. You're going to build a line of four on top of it. So go one, two, three, four, like that. So you've got an over, a block hanging over like that. And then you want two rows of three behind that. So one, two, three, one, two, three. And then two rows of two. One, two, one, two. Like so. And then I think back two. One, two. And then ten. Back ten. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then down three. One, two two, three, like that. And that creates an open promenade similar to what you have on the Titanic. So if you look on the prototype you can see you've got the open little promenades there. You've got one of those already started now. So you've got the front promenade done like that. And then after the uh, <coughs> excuse me the um, oh, the pillar there down like that. You're going to want to add three, uh, how many windows? Do we want uh, ten windows. So I'm going to build a window but I put a block at the bottom first, so a block and then a window and then two blocks and then but basically just building ten windows spaced by a block so two windows and then three windows basically just put blocks underneath them first and then that's four windows five windows six seven eight nine 
10, you've got 10 windows like that. You've got, remember, you've got to put blocks underneath them to make them stand up. So, yeah, it's a bit confusing that one. So, you've got 10 windows like that. And then add pillars in between. Like so. And then at the end of the windows, you're going to add a pillar of. Uh, you know, we want the pillar of two, so two blocks pillar, so one, four, three blocks high, and then another one, three blocks high like that, the end of the window like that. And then we'll add a line across the top of the window, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen like that, so cover up your windows like so. Can't really tell from these angles because it's all white and funny colours, but it's there nonetheless. So there's the windows anyway, and this pillar here. So what we're going to do now is build some more open promenade. So go from the top block again, which is this one. And we're going to build a line of 76. That's seven six blocks. So I put the first block there. And we'll measure as I go along. So I want 76 in total. a little bit of time to get used to, so that's 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, so that's 76 as it is, it says on the bottom of the pink, and then at the end of the 76 you want to go down three again, so one, two, three, so this is another open promenade in this area here, really can't see because it's all white, but that's the open promenade there, so at the end of the open promenade where it goes down three, we want to add uh, four more windows. So I put a block, and then a window, and then another window. That's two windows, three windows, and four windows. You have four windows like that, and then fill in the spaces in between. And at the end, add another pillar to mark the end of the windows, like so. So you got four windows, like that. So you got four windows plus the white around the outside. And then add the line across the top again, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, like that. And then from the top line again, from the top block, you're going to build another open promenade. And this one is going to be 48, so 48 blocks. So I put the first block there, and then what 48, so it's another line of 48 all along the side. And that is. 50, so I've gone two blocks too far, and that's 48, there we are, so 48 there like that. And then at the end of the 48, you build inwards, so build in five, one, two, three, four, five, and then back seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then inwards 14, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and a colour block to mark the centre, there we go, so that lines up with the centre block at the bottom. <coughs> There we go, apologies for me coughing, but there we go. So that's that bit done there. That's one side. And uh, it's taking a long time, that is. Anyway, what we'll do now, we'll go back to the, the wall of four windows there. And we're going to add a line of blocks going from the back all the way to the back end of the 48. So just add a line of blocks under the 48 blocks long again, following the contours of the, of the deck of bluff. So just follow a line of 48 blocks along the bottom. Oh, too far. And there we go, so 48 blocks under this like so. Like that, and it don't look too bad. And then we want then we're gonna add some pillars and we we'll go from the from the uh, from the go, <laughs> go to the four windows again. And then these pillars are gonna be every fourth block again, I think. Let me just work it out. I think it's let me just go to the prototype a second, because I think it's about right. Yeah, I think it's fine. So it's every fourth block again. So from the windows, go one, two, three, four, add a pillar. One, two, three, four, 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 pillar. Four pillar. Four pillar. One, two, three, four, 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 pillar. There we are. So the last pillar is right at the end, and it should look something like that. It doesn't look much at the moment because. It's hard to make out anything because it's all white. And then in the corners, just add another stair block like that. And then between the four windows and the front ten windows, add a line of blocks again underneath. 
connecting them up, so this will be pillars again. So just build all the way forward underneath. Up to the to line of ten windows there. And then it'll be the same process again, so every fourth block will be a window again, uh, a pillar, so from the front ten go one, two, three, four, pillar, 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 there we go, so there's all our pillars added, and then just add your corner, stair block, so stair block in there, and a stair block at the other corner, like so. And there we go, there's our open promenade area done, like so. So that's one side done. I think what I'll do, I'll do the basics of the other side as well. So I won't do all the pillars and things, but I'll do the windows and the, the walls. So I'll just go to the other side. Maybe I'll just sort my notes out for this one. <coughs> and then what we're going to do, so we've done, the, done one side. So the middle wall's already five high, so the row of five on the other side, build that to four high, like that. Four high, not five high, so it's four high like that. And then the row of three, make that a line of four. So one, two, three, four. And then two rows of three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Two rows of two. One, two, one, two. And then back two. And then ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then down three. One, two, 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 three, like that. So there we go. There's our front curve like that. And then it was, what was it, 10 windows, wasn't it? So I put a block, a block, and then a window, and then a gap, and then a window, gap, and then window, gap, and then a window, gap, windows. How many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 10, so it's 10 windows like so. And then fill in the gaps in between. And then what was at the end? It was two pillars, wasn't it? So two blocks of pillars at the end, so one, two, three, one, two, three, like that. And then connect them across the top, so add a line of blocks across the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, like that. So there's your front 10 windows, and then it was a line then of 76, so top block, <coughs> a line of 76, so I'll measure as I go along, so 76 is what we want. How far is that? That's 75, and then 76, yep that's fine, so 76, and then it was down 3 again, one, Two, three, marvelous, and then it was uh, four windows on it. So I put a block, and then a window gap, and then two windows, three windows, four windows. So there we go. There's the windows like that, and then we add the pillar. Hang on, we add the pillars in between first, like that, and then a single pillar at the end, three high, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight across the top. So there's your four windows there, and then another line of blocks which was 48, so I put the first block there, and then we want a line of 48, so measure, measure as we go along again, so 48 blocks, how far that's 36, and that's 48, that's fine, 48 like so, and then we build inwards, uh, 5, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, back seven one two three four five six seven and then inwards fourteen so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen like so and there we are and then it was back towards the line of four windows just add a line of seventy six uh, add a line of forty eight sorry underneath the top line of forty eight for the space for the pillars like so and then add your pillars I do them in a the jump cap, I just get these blocks in the way, and then we just do the same between the 76. So, add the line in there. And 
And there we go. There is our, our walls done like that. So I've done the windows. What you need to do now is just add the pillars. Every fourth block and add the corner blocks as well. And also the doors and windows. And then we shall move on from there. So what I'm going to do. Hang on. What we need to do first as well. Is to add the deck. So we'll go, we'll go to the front. So once you've done all those pillars and windows and doors. You can add the deck. So go from the front wall here of 11 wide. And the deck will go from there. On the inside. And it will go all the way to the back end. So All the way to the back end of the... Uh, overhang so just carry on building that deck all the way to the back end and like I said do all the other jobs and then we can move on so um back in a moment I'm out of breath <laughs> yeah so back in a moment okay back again so I've added all the pillars and the deck and the ship should look something like that also done all the doors and windows on the inside of the wall so everything so far should look tickety-boo so just look on the inside to give you an idea Got the open corridor, promenade thing, and got all the doors and windows and so forth. So that is one, that's both sides done and the deck added. Next job we want to do now is to finish off the front end of the open promenade. So what we're going to do is at the front of the ships, or front of the ship per, is in this open promenade here which hasn't been sort of decorated yet. We're going to go from the where the windows begin, we're just going to build a wall all the way around the front of the superstructure, around to the other side. So we're just going to join each section up as well, like so, and then just build all the way around to the other side and there will be there will be some stairs added to these walls later on but we'll worry about those during the fitting out process so I'm just going to go all the way back to the other side and add our wall there there we go there's the wall added and then we're going to get our <coughs> get our pillars and we're going to go from the corner block on the inside here and we're going to go to the third block forward so one two three add a pillar and then leave a block gap, add a pillar, leave a block gap, add a pillar. So it's, the pillars are like that. I think that's how it is. Gosh, look at the prototypes. Hard to tell from the prototype, actually. So I think it's three pillars like that. Let me just double check it because I've not written this thing down. So, yeah, it is three pillars, as you can see. I thought it might have been an extra one because of how far, far forward the, the whole section is. But that is fine. Got your three pillars in there. And the deck above would be the same as well. It'd be the same design. So we just sort this out the other side first so there's your three pillars and then in the corner block you add your stairs like that to create a sort of open flange that's very reminiscent of said Titanic so do the same on the other side so two blocks forward of the open bit or third block forward and then add a pillar leave a gap pillar leave a gap pillar so there's your three pillars and your stair gap spacer thing there. and there you go so that is that job done there and that's how it looks all marvellous and neat uh, so yeah, then now we move on to the next deck now. So we're going to go to the front wall of the deck we just built Which is to here and onto the centre block and on the centre block We're going to count back on the wood to the fourth block back So one two three four at a centre block like so and we're going to build the inside walls first So they're going to be eleven wide again. So that's five either side one two three four five that way one two three four five that way like so and then curving around to the side, we'll just do one side first. We want to go out four, one, two, three, four, three, one, two, three, two, two, one, two, one, two, and then two back, one, two, and then back four, one, two, three, four, and then we want 15, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifteen, and then we want a line of 111, so that's one, 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 all the way back. So I'll put a first block there, so we want 111 back along the side. Marvellous, isn't it? La, 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 la. Oh, missed one. And these walls, when they're all built, will be three blocks high. Okay, so I'll just get the uh, the easy bit out of the way. Of, well, I'll say the easy bit, but the not so fun bit. Uh, how far there? That is 113. So I've gone two blocks too far. And oh, oh shit! I think that's 111 anyway. <laughs> I'll measure it again just to make sure because I clicked the wrong thing. <sighs> yeah, for the, 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 the. All right, so that's the beginning. Oh, yeah, it's 111. That's fine. So 111 is what we want. So yeah, that's 111. And then at the end of the 111, we build in three, one, two, three, and then build back 35. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 
30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So 35 back like that. I just measure that as well to make sure. Because you know me and my counting. So that's 35. That's fine. As it says at the end of the pink thing. And at the end of the 35 you build in 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And a centre block. Bonk, there. And that shouldn't... Yep, that measures up with the centre block on the deck below. That's fine. And I just double check looking at the prototype from here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, then we just do the other side. And then, like I say, increase those walls to three high. I am taking my time with this. I'm rather taking time than wasting time, but there we go. So at the end of the 11, the other side, we just do the four. One, two, three, four, three. One, two, three. And then the two, two, and back two. That's fine. And then the four. One, two, three, four. And then the 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And then we want the 11, 111. I just I use the stack tool for this one because it's going to take a little while so I'll do stack uh, 110 because there's one there already so that's 111 added there so that's to that point there so that's 111 and then in 3 1, 2, 3 and then the 35 so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35 and then in 11 so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 there we go that's all lined up marvellous nice and neat beautiful things like that okay now you increase those walls to 3 high and then you can start adding your doors and windows if you want to I mean, it's up that op optional those are those sort of things then so just do across the back first to do set courts and then we we'll go down the sides I may may do a copy paste for one side because it does take a little a little bit of time and I am using welded it again so if you if you are offended by this I do apologize but it does save a little bit of time best thing to do is pause the video and then fill it all in yourself using freehand if you want to do that of course these front bits need to be filled in freehand because they're so small and awkward and well let it just screw it all up so just do one side there and then go into the other side I may as well do it all and I do it all want it uh, the whole both sides like this no point doing a copy paste Okay, that's one side done, just do the other side quickly. God, it's warm in here. Na 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 Bump, bump. And then do this bit quickly as well, and then the last bit down to the back. Like so. And there we go. Now, like I was saying, you can start adding your doors and windows to these walls, because they're, they're effectively the same as the deck below. They're inside walls, so start roughly the same position on the deck here. And let's say put a pair of well, okay, you can't start in the same position because they're slightly further back, but let's say put a pair of doors there, like so, and then just carry on doing the doors or windows all the way back. I just do a few for give you an idea. Oop, missed one. I keep destroying the wrong one. There we go. So there's, there's a, there's a rough idea. So you've got a pair of doors, a shit ton of windows, and a pair of doors. So how many windows? Are that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven windows and a pair of doors. Carry on that same process again if you want to. Um, like I say, it's a fictional ship, so you can do what you like with it, really. But uh, hey, here, there we go. Anyway, so that's the doors and windows sort of explained. So what we're going to do now is go back to the front wall, and we're going to build the bridge wings and the overhang and the open promenade. So we go to the uh, front of the ship the front of the walls rather and we're going to increase this front wall of 11 to four block high so build that four high like that and then we're going to build out from the next row behind here we're going to build out five so one two three four five so you've got an overhang by one block there that's fine so it's five and then you want four one two three four so each section is linked up by one so it's three five four and then two rows of three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then two rows of four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then back three, one, two, three. And then in three, one, two, three, like that. And that should 
be right above the foundation of the deck below. So you can see that end block, that last block of three is there. So it was so the front wall was eleven high and it's five, four, three, three, four, four, back three, in three. And while I'm explaining that I can do the other side, can I? So it's out five, one, two, three, four, five, four, one, two, three, four. And then three, one, two, three, three, one, two, three. And then four, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, back three, one, two, three, in three, one, two, three, and that's right above the right position as well. So that's fine. So there's your bridge wings laid out. Yeah, it should look something like that. And then for the sides, we're going to extend the deck along the side, well, slightly, because we've got windows to put on. So we're going to go from the end of the three, we're going to go and add four back. So from the row of three, build back four. So one, two, three, four. And then down three, one, two, three, like that. And this will be right above the la the first block of the windows down below. So you, you'll have the same open promenade bit on the front here, so what's down below. So, so it's back four, down three. And then we're going to add seven windows. So uh, how is it when we do this one? So, put the first, so behind this pillar here, we'll put, put our windows. So our first window will be there. And we've got seven of them. So that's one, and then two. Three. Remember to put a block underneath them first. That's three windows, four windows, five, six, and seven. Seven windows like that. And then at the end of that, you want to add a three blocks. Three blocks. One, two, three, and make that three high. One, two, three, like that. So you've got seven windows plus a three space like that. And then we add pillars in between. And duh, like that, and then you can add a line up to actually, uh, yeah, we'll do that in a minute. So, after the row of three, we'll add another set of windows. We'll add six windows this time. So, I'll put our first block and then one window, two windows, three windows, four windows, five windows, and then six windows, six windows like that, and then a two spacer. So, two blocks make that three high, like so. And then add your pillars in between, like so. And then you can add the line of blocks across the top. So go from the first block just by the front window all the way to the, the two block spacer. So just add the line across the top, like so. Going back to the spacer of two, like that. So there's your windows all closed in, like that. Marvellous. And then after that, we want to extend the open promenade, so the, basically the top block, just going to extend that, and we're going to build that uh, 100 blocks, so put the first block there, and we'll build 100 blocks, so that's how we want to go. <laughs> oh, how far is that? That is... That's 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. There we go, so that's 100 blocks there, like so. And then what we want to do now is to build that inwards. So 100 blocks back and then build it inwards, uh, 8. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And that will attach to the foundation, or the walls, the three block high walls, near the back here, like so. So there we go, that is... Uh, that bit attached there. So the rest of the wall down to the back end, this part here behind where the, the row of eight attaches, just want to increase the height of the wall to four high, all the way down to the back corner, and then across the back as well. So go across to the center right there, just up to the center block. And so when you do the other side, extend the wall down, and that'll come up to the center as well. So that's one side done. And it should look something like that. So once all the doors or windows are in place, it will look a lot better. But that is how that should look. So what we want to do now is to go back to where the windows are. And we just want to go from the bottom now, just below where we added that 100. We're going to add another 100 but below, so on the bottom there. So and then, we, then we add the pillars in between. So we'll add the damn it, that 100 underneath, so I'll have a gap. So there's our, an, our underhang, if you like. Can't really tell because it's so bloody 
light under there, really hard to use light. Anyway, so that's that bit done. So now what we're going to do now is add our pillars. And these pillars will go in exactly the same position as the pillars below. So your first pillar, so there's a four block gap from the wall, so one, two, three, four, or three block gap, and then on the fourth block add a pillar. So there you go. Pillars directly above each other. That's what I like about these sort of things. The pillars do line up. Nine times out of ten they do not. But uh, we'll get them in place anyway. And just basically just add pillars all the way to the end of the overhang here. And then everything should be fine. That is the theory anyway. So this is all just one side as well, because I haven't got to do the other side yet. Uh, so then you just got to keep adding the pillars, because of course the pillars down below end there. So one, two, three, four, add a pillar. 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 There we go, so the pillars all line up again, that's fine. Do those windows down there just interrupted the flow, but that's fine. Don't know how many pillars there are exactly, but we'll just carry on doing what we're doing. And there we go, there's our pillars added there. So that is two open promenade thingy what's it's there. And uh, it don't look too bad. So that's one side. Oh, I should, oh, I've got to add the stair block as well inside the corner. So I'll add the stairs just there. Bonk. And uh, there we go, so that's not too bad. So I'll do I'll quickly do the other side, because why not? So the other side was four back, wouldn't it? So one, two, three, four, and then down three. One, two, three. Like that. And then just we can you just carry on doing this. It's exactly the same process. You do the same windows, so it's six hang on, how many windows? It's seven windows. So I'll put the first I'll do the I'll do the windows, why not? So one window, two windows, three windows, four windows, five windows, six windows. Seven windows, there you go. Seven windows plus the three spacer at the end. Plus the pillars in between. And then the six windows, wouldn't it? So one window, two windows, three windows, four windows, five windows, and six windows plus the two at the end. Like that. Build the pillars in between. And then the blocks across the top, so just build the blocks across the top of the windows. Like so, and there we go, there's the uh, windows done on the front. And uh, that's how it should look on the prototype anyway, so once you've got all the pillars and the windows and the deck on top, it'll all look like that. So, uh, so what I'll do, what's the, now, so the next job is to add the 100, so I'll just... I would use stack, but of course I don't have the stack tool available from this direction, so I'll just build the 100 again. That is 99, 100. Yeah, so make sure 100, yep. At the end of the 100, build in 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That attaches to the walls. And then just extend, increase the height of the walls behind that pillar, but or behind that line, around the back, to the centre block at the back there. Remember to leave the walls in, in, the, in the front part to 3 high, because the deck will sit on top of that. But There we go. So there's our walls added there. So... The next thing you need to do is just add the deck, so what you do then, just go from the inside of, or wherever, the inside walls or the inside of the promenade, just add your deck inside of the overhang like so, and then just build that deck all the way down to the back over there, all the way to the other side, all the way to the front. And uh, I shall do the rest of this in the jump cut, so I shall add the deck, and I'll also add the pillars as well, because I mean, the pillars take a little bit of time, so like I say, I'll, I'll sort out the pillars, sort out the deck and the doors or windows, and then we should come back after the jump cut, so uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again, so there's the deck added and all the pillars and windows and doors things done, so we'll just quickly look around and look inside the promenade, got all the doors and windows there. Remember, these are just randomly placed, so these are sort of eight windows and then a pair of doors, eight windows, pair of doors, but I've done them all the way to the back uh, on the inside here, so this row of uh, 35 as well, I've added the doors and windows, but not across the back, so I've left those blank walls all those back walls blank for now so that's how that should be uh, next job I want to do I'm just going to do a quick little job here uh, involving stairs and these, but first we're going to do the front portion like we did at the front so just go to the front where the open promenade begins and do the same design as down below so we just go from where the windows begin and add our wall around the front of our superstructure around the front of the deck 
to the other side. Like so, and then add your pillars in exactly the same position as the ones below, so directly above the pillars below. So put a pillar, space, pillar, space, pillar, and then the stair block in the corner there. There you go. So there's your now. Now, now there is your two open promenade beginning thingy what sits there. And do the same the other side. So look at the pillars below, add your window, add your pillars to above, space, pillar, space, pillar. Very awkward things to add, and then just your corner block. There you go. So there's your open promenades there. Marvellous. So one more job to do before I do another big jump cut is to add some stairs. These are sort of similar again to what Titanic had. So we're going to go to the front wall of the top deck we have. And on the wood we're going to count back to the 13th block. So that's the first block. So that's 5, 10, 11, 12, 13. So I'll put a centre block there for a minute or a marker. And then we're going to go out from the side of that. 14. So it's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So on the 14th block, we're going to cut a hole. So one block there and build that four, cut it four wide. So two, three, four. Like so. And this does look quite uh, an awkward design. Let me just double check because it is one block close or one block close to the edge of the deck. I just want to make sure that's the same because, you know, may I do screw things up and yeah, that's fine. So we're just building a stairwell basically. So ow, a leg. So cut it four wide, and then the sides four, so back four, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then remove all the guff in between. So now you have a big space like that. And then for the sides, front and other side, add a line of white, like so, like that. And then what we do on the inside, we just go from the back part, back part and add stairs going down. So just go on the inside. These stairs are going down facing towards the front, so do stairs two blocks wide going down to deck below like so and then we'll add our blocks underneath and then the side wall the other side of the stairs just build that down to the deck below as well so it closes off the stairwell like so and also do it around the back as well make sure that closes all off and there we go so there we are there's our stairwell Go for a jaunt up the top, and then we can add a wall around the outside, like so. And there's your stairwell like that. You can enclose it if you want to, make it a bit more <laughs> fancy. But you know, that's your stairwell done there. And then we just do the same the other side. So it's back 13 to that block there, and then it's out 14. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And we we'll cut our four block wide hole, four box, four blocks back. One, two, three, four, and remove all the gubbins inside, and then add our inside wall like so, or a liner basically, and then add our stairs going down. There we go, and then add the blocks for support. No, they're not really important because they're going to be enclosed in, and then build the side wall down to the deck like so. Actually, not too far forward. And then and close the back. There we go. So there's our stairs done there. And then add the wall. Like so. And there we are. There's our two stairwells. And you can remove that centre block now. We don't need that. Bonk. And there we go. So that's that little bit of detail done there. The ship does is definitely taking shape because I mean we've got most of the silhouette done now. So what I'm going to do now. I should do another jump cut because we're not, next we're going to work on the. Uh, funnel supports and the ship's wheelhouse so uh, I shall return in just a moment okay back again so what we're going to do now is move on to the ship's wheelhouse and the funnel supporting deck houses so I'm going to go down to the front wall of the deck we just built and we're going to add a wall around the bridge wings around, or around from the front around the bridge wings and down the side slightly so start of the center just add our wall around the edge like so and around the back of the bridge wings and then where the back in again and where the bridge wings go back in you're just going to build 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 back like so, so 12 back like that or make it 11 rather so it didn't attach like that, yeah make it 11 so there we go and then do the same on the other side, just go out like 
so. And then in again and then back 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There we go. So there's the front walls done. Now we're going to go back to the centre and we're going to add the bridge uh, wheelhouse itself. So we'll start with the windows. We're going to add seven windows. So we'll put a centre window like that, two blocks high. And then three other sides. So leave a gap, window, gap, window, gap, window. So three windows that side. And then one, two, three that side. So there's your seven windows. Then add a pillar on the ends and between each window. Like so. So your windows look like that. And then for the sides, go behind the side pillar and we're going to build the sides uh, seven back. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then out two, one, two, and then back four. One, two, three, four. There we go. And do the same the other side. Back seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Out two, and back four. One, two, three, four. Like so. And it's got a small deck house as well, but there we go. And then just build it back, build it back, build the back across like so. And then I put a colour block to mark the centre, so I, I know where my marker is. That's not the centre, that's the centre. So the central window, centre, there we go. And then, as per usual, just build it all to four blocks high. Like so, so build side walls, like so. Takes a bit of time to do, but there we go. One side in the back, let's do the other side quickly. Da -da 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 -da. There we go, so there's the deck house sort of done. And then for the front wall going over the top of the windows, you're going to build one forward overhanging, like so. And then build, and do the other side as well, build the other side, and then build inwards two, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 11 rather over the top and then do the same the other side so add two there like that no just two there we go <laughs> as long as you've got an overhang by one block you're fine so it should look something like that and then you can add the deck itself which would be uh, the floor just add those blocks there, there we go. so just gonna add wood blocks for the roof like so so the roof will go on the inside like so so I'm going to use the fill tool just to fill this in quickly so fill wood by 200 and that fills in the whole thing and there you go there's the first deck house almost done so what we need to do now is just add doors or windows so for the side just add a window a pair of doors and then a window and then on the row of four uh, the five side bit just add two windows in there like so so there's one side done do the same the other side so a pair of window or a window and then a pair of doors then a window there and then a pair of windows on that side there we go so there's that deck house there one more job on the uh, front of the wheelhouse and on the top there we just add another wall another line of blocks across the front top like that and then out to the side like so and then down the side four one two three four like that do the same the other side out the three and then out back side four one two three four like that so you got an overhang plus a wall like so and that's your wheelhouse done like that. Should be definitely taking shape. Right, so that's that first deck house done. What we do now, we go down to, about, to the back of the bridge wheelhouse. You can add windows and doors if you want on the back wall, but I'm just going to leave it blank because no one's hardly going to see it. Uh, bear with me as I read my notes. Right, so for the next deck house, we're going to go to the back wall, like I was saying, and then go to the centre block, and we're going to go from the wood, go back to the fourth block back. So one, two, three, four. Put our centre block there. And then this front wall of this deck house will be 13 wide, so that is uh, 6 other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 that way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 that way. Like that. And then we're going to build back 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Each side, I'll just do one side for a minute. So back 4. And then out 3. 1, 2, 3. And then we want 29 back, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and then out 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and then out 3, 1, 2, 3, 
back 23, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and then in 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then back 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, like that. So that's one side like so. Let's double check the product don't yeah, that's fine. Now let's do the same on the other side. <laughs> So it was back four, one, two, three, four, out three, one, two, three, and then back 29. I won't bother counting it, I just measure as I go along because <laughs> I'm lazy. I'm just compare it to the other side. So we answered back 29, out three, one, two, three, and then back 23. Like so, and then in five, one, two, three, four, five, and then back 10. And then build the back wall, join it all together. And then find your centre block, which I believe is that one. So how how wide is the back wall? Back wall is 15, so the middle will be 8. That one there, so make that the centre block there. And then just increase those to four blocks high all the way around. Like so, just build four high. All the way around. I'm just using well did it again because I'm a lazy mother. Huffer. Did you get it? I should have just done a jump cut, shouldn't I? I just built the walls up. That's what I hate about these sort of deck houses. They're so awkward design, but that's the way I designed them, so there we go. Anyway, there we are. There's a deck house done like that. So we're all four blocks high. And then as before, we'll add the deck, which will go along the top line again. So just add the deck in this area here. So, and I should just stand on this block and use the fill tool again to fill in the whole thing. There we go. So there's our deck house done like so, and it should look something like that. Now for the doors or windows, we'll leave those for a minute. But we're going to add some stairs first. So you've got the front wall here, which is 11 wide or 13 wide. Then it goes sideways. Then you got this out wall here, which is three wide. Just going to add some stairs in there. So remove the top two blocks, and then we'll add stairs going down like so and then the box underneath and then the banisters two up two up two up and then do the same the other side remove the two blocks at the top then the stairs going down like so blocks underneath and then two up two up two up and there we go stairs added in there like that and then it's going to be the same on the back as well, so on the back walls. Got the back wall here, which I think was 15 wide, and then you go forward to the row of 10, and you got the row of 5 going in. Do the same there, so two blocks closer to the wall, remove the top two, and replace the stairs going down like so. Blocks, blocks, and then two up, two up, two up. That side, and then the same on the other side. Remove two blocks, and then stairs, stairs. Stairs and stairs, blocks and blocks, and then banisters. Two up, two, two up, two up. There we go. So there's that deck house done like that. And like I say, started in the doors and windows and things. Um, I think once again it's sort of random, so I'm just going to start at one end and just add a pair of doors and then windows, windows, and windows. You can probably put, say, seven or eight windows and a pair of doors and then just carry, just carry on doing the same do any sort of routine you want with the doors and windows because like I say they're not accurate to anything they're just randomly placed so the best thing to do is just go ahead and do what you want um, but I'm going to do I should do a quick jump cut when I sort the doors and windows out here and then we should move on to the next deck house so um, back in a moment 
Okay, back again. So that's the doors and windows added. And what I did, I did two. Do I did a pair of doors and then one, two, three, four, five win uh, six windows, and a pair of doors and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten windows and a pair of doors, then stairs and then a window and a door and then five windows across the back. So that's what I did for that deck house, and it should look something like that. Now this deck house would be the support for funnel number one and number two. So funnel one, funnel two will go there. And then the next deck house will be funnel three and four, so I'll worry about those another day. I really am dreading doing those funnels, because I mean, look at them. <laughs> but we'll work something out. Right, anyway, for the next deck house, we go to the back wall of deck house we've just done. And on the wood, centre block, we're going to count back to the tenth back. So one, now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then put a centre block there. And then this deck house will have bridge wings on it, so it'll have wings going out each uh, each side and front and back. But we'll worry about those in a second. So for this deck house, it's going to be 21 wide, so that's uh, 10 each yeah. 10 each side. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, like that. And then the sides we want 25 back, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. And then out 2, 1, 2. And then back 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. In 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then back 32. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. There we are. That's a big old deck house. That's 32, right? Okay, so do, <laughs> do the same on the other side. So the side was 25. And I hope I got this right. I'm just reading my notes. So this side 25. Like that, and what was it? Out two, one, two, back six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Are you sure it's six? There must be, so it's back six, and then in five, one, two, three, four, five, and then back 32. In there. So I'm not counting it, I'm just measuring and comparing to the other side because I'm using the lines on the deck to, as a reference. So back like so, and then across the back, one, two, two. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, so centre block will be about there, I think. Yep, there we go, so there's our deck house done like that. I'm just going to quickly look at the prototype, so that row of 6 does concern me slightly, but I think I'm just panicking for nothing, and yeah, that's fine, okay. So that's the deck house done like that. We're not going to build the walls up just yet, because what we want to do now is go to the front wall, so we'll start at the front end. So the front wall here, we're going to build that 4 high, so 2, 3, 4, all the way across. So it's 20, uh, 4 high like that. And then we're going to build out from the top block from here. We're going to build out 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Or, in more English terms, out to the edge of the ship like that. So it's out 10 and then back 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then back in 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then down 2, 1, 2, like that, to connect to the foundation, like that, so that's one side, do the same the other side, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, back 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then in 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then down 2, there we are. So that's our front wall done like that. And then the area between the pillar and the front wall, just build that up to three high. Like so, do the same on the other side. Because when we come to add the deck, the deck will sit in this area on top of these walls here. So that's the front part, and then we just go to the back part. And the back wall is going to be the same to so the back wall. Slightly, the back wall is going to be uh, four high as well, so build this four high. Slightly narrower, but that's fine. So build this one four high, like so. And then from the top blocks again, we're going to build out uh, five. So one, two, three, four, five. And this is only goes as far as the of the superstructure below. So out five, 
and then forward four, one, two, three, four, and then in five, one, two, three, four, five, down two, one, two, like that. And then the same on the other side, one, two, three, four, five out, forward four, one, two, three, four, in five, one, two, three, four, five, down two, like that. And then the bits in between, build up to three high, like so. And then the area between the bridge, bridge, bridge wing, the walls here, just build them to four high or to the height of the bridge wings themselves, like that. So just all these walls increase in height. So I'm going to use world edit again because I'm lazy. Where's quartz there? No, I shouldn't do this, but yeah. That's one side done. I'll just quickly do the other side. <laughs> Breeze on the server as well. She's probably swearing at me right now because I'm using well in it, but never mind. <laughs> so there you go. There is the deck house is all added there, and it should look something like that. So what I'm going to do now is then to add the deck. So once again the deck will go inside these bridge wings and add the deck in there like that. And that deck will go all the way forward so I shall stand over here and just use the fill tool to fill in the whole thing. Like so. And that is the deck house all filled in like so. So that is that how that should be like that. Um, and that's the second deck house. It's almost done. All I need to do now is just add the doors and windows. Once again, I shall just use the random things. I just use doors at the beginning and then windows, like so. And I shall do a jump cut while I finish that off. So there's a little bit more detail to do, but we'll do those windows first. So I should do a jump cut now. And actually, there needs to be stairs. And then, yeah, there's stairs. So ignore those windows. Go right where the bridge wing reattaches. The front, these are the front bridge wings. So where these reattach to the side of the deck house, need to put stairs in again. So I forgot about these. So put the bloody stairs in, like that, and then blocks underneath, and then the banisters two up, two up, two up. Same on the other side. Put the stairs in, and the blocks. Two up, two up, two up. So that's those stairs down there. And then the other bridge, uh, the other stairs would go to the back of the other bridge wings, or the front of the bridge wings. And these are only single stairs, so I remove one block and just put one set of stairs going down like so. Plus the blocks underneath. So two up, two up, two up. Same the other side. Stairs, 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 stairs block 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 and then two up two up two up there we go so there's those stairs done there now, now what I say I'm going to add the doors on windows so I've already screwed this up a little bit so I've got the first few door first doors and a couple of windows under there and then move that window there so from the stairs I put another few windows and then a pair of doors in there and I just go from there really. Um, so what I'm going to do, do another jump cut while I do some more random stuff. And then we can do some finishing off details. So I shall return in just a moment. Okay, back again. So I've added all the doors and windows. And what I did, across the front wall I added seven windows. So seven windows across there. And then for the sides I added a pair of doors and a window behind the stairs. And then one, two, three, four windows and a pair of doors three windows down there and then two windows on the inside wall or inner wall or in wall and then two doors one two three four five six seven windows to the stairs and then a pair of doors and then five windows across the back so that's what I did windows wise there now before I do any more detail I'm going to go to the back end of the sort of top deck which is here so where the top deck curves back in so you've got the pillars just below right here so where the deck curves back in the last two blocks of the deck here we're going to put a wall of two blocks there and then you're going to build all the way in so it's basically just add a wall all the way in and follow the contours of the deck itself all the way back 
and then all the way across to make the center block on the back like so. So it basically just adds, makes that area slightly taller. So as you can see you've got the end of the end of the you know, the bridge wings down the end there of the main deck. The deck goes all the way back and ends at this point to the last two blocks at a wall and just build all the way around to meet the center. Do the same on the other side, so the last two blocks of the top deck add two blocks there and then just build or build back following the contours of the deck until you get to the center block like so. There we go, so that's just a wall added there and it don't look too bad. Now one more job to do is to add pillars for the uh, for the bridge wing. So the bridge, what I used is uh, birch fence for this. So I'm going to add three pillars for the uh, for the, these are the back bridge wings. Okay, so these are the smaller ones. So I put a pillar, two blocks high. Three of them like so. So three pillars there. Do the same the other side. Like that. And then we want to go to the front uh, bridge wings, which are over here. And we're going to add four of them. So we're going to add. Uh, from the front or front corner, we're going to add a pillar going down three blocks, like so, and then leave a gap. Add another pillar, like so, and then go to the back of the de of the bridge wing. Add a pillar down, leave a gap, and then a pillar down, like so. So you have four pillars, like that. So that's that bridge wing there. So do the same the other side on this one. The four pillars again. So uh, one, two, two, three high. Leave a gap, one, two, three high. To the back, one, two, three high. No. Three high, and then one, two, three high. There you go. So there's your four pillars there. And that is the majority of the superstructure done. I know we've not done the, the touch the stern deck house, but that is something we can do in one part near the end. So that that's what I'm going to do for today anyway. This is a huge build we've done. We've done all the hull in part one, all of the superstructure mainly in part two. So for part three... I'm thinking funnels, vents, and fitting out areas, sort of. Uh, but wait and see, see what I come up with. But that was what I'm thinking. So we have the pro, we have the main uh, profile of the ship done. Still plenty to do though. So yeah, I think funnels maybe for part three, funnels, masts, and things like that. But we'll wait and see. But that's what I'm going to do for today. So this is me, Rich, signing off, logging off, and disappearing. And I shall return in part three, so uh, bye for now.